1742, a man by the name of P.J. Malloy described a method of coating iron by dipping it in molten zinc in a presentation to the French Royal Academy. Today, this method is known as galvanizing. Galvanizing is corrosion protection of steel. What we're going to do is combine iron from the steel with zinc in the molten zinc bath to form a protective layer on the surface of the steel to give us a long-term product that will survive in the environment. Galvanizing gives two basic corrosion protection mechanisms. The first is a barrier on the steel to not allow the environment to change the steel properties by oxidizing and corroding the steel. Second is when you have steel exposed to the environment, that galvanized coating around that exposed area provides what we call cathodic protection, meaning it sacrifices itself to protect the steel. Throughout the world, Hot dip galvanized steel has been used to provide unmatched protection against corrosion. At present, galvanizing is found in almost every major application and industry where iron or mild steel is used. And it continues to grow in both traditional existing markets as well as new and emerging ones. Well, hot dip galvanizing is such an important part of your everyday life. It's sort of the hidden backbone of so much of our infrastructure. It's something that we rely on every day that we take for granted. The American Galvanizers Association is a collective of North American companies, galvanizers who apply zinc to steel to protect it from corrosion, and suppliers to the industry of raw materials and equipment. Joined together for one purpose, and that is to promote an increase in the use of hot dip galvanized steel. Once used solely as a means of corrosion protection, hot dip galvanizing is now specified for many other reasons. For this parking facility, we looked at hot dip galvanizing for a number of reasons, but primarily because of its sustainability and its maintenance and durability components. The building had a requirement to be a 100-year building, and so longevity was key. That overlaps with the tenets of sustainability where building a new building every few years doesn't make a lot of sense. In many instances, when steel is used on a project such as a parking facility like this, it's painted, it creates a maintenance scenario, and it's something that the ownership has to reapply every couple years. Hot dip galvanizing is a way for them to reduce the maintenance to practically zero and have a long life and durable structure. Denver Zoo's used hot dip galvanizing for years in almost every project we have. Some of the recent projects like Predator Ridge, lions, hyenas, and wild dogs, a lot of hose down in the humid environment, and it's really important to have hot dip galvanizing to protect our steel in those buildings. In Toyota Elephant Passage, we have big steel and big elephants. They rub against that steel, and actually paint really won't last in that situation, but hot dip galvanizing will. Now, sometimes we use hot dip galvanizing because we think it looks cool, like here at the edge. We think hot dip galvanizing is the best way to prevent corrosion and failure of the critical components that we build in to take care of our animals, and of course, that's the most important part of the zoo. Hot dip galvanizing is often the hidden backbone in the structures we visit, roads we travel, and a major part of our infrastructure. A lot of our infrastructure was built 50 years or more ago, and it's starting to look its age. And there's a lot of issues with crumbling and deterioration of the infrastructure. And part of the reason for that is just because it wasn't built to last as long as it's been in place and to sustain the amount of traffic or the amount of homes that are being powered. And it hasn't been maintained the way it should have been because there weren't the dollars there to maintain it. What galvanizing can bring to the infrastructure market is to basically build things and forget about them. So you can spend all your money on the new projects and not on the maintenance going back to fix things that were already built. I've been the county engineer for 12 years now. I've been practicing engineering for about 30. Working with steel structures has been a very big plus. We're able to take and mend and add and extend the life of our structures. Some of the stuff that we did have was galvanized, mostly our, our tubular rail and our bridges, those types of things. Seeing the wear and tear and, and the beating that they really take and the coating just just holding up to the harsh chemicals that we currently have. You basically, you build it and forget it. It's commendable to the galvanizing industry of what product is out there and how it lasts and what it's worth and what benefit we reap into our counties for our local people that helps our smaller budgets. As a society, we continue to move toward more sustainable development. And that's something intrinsic to galvanizing. 
The tenets of sustainability require that you look at social, economic, and environmental factors. The majority of people will focus strictly on environmental factors, which although important are not the whole story because if you build the most environmentally friendly structure but you haven't thought about the economics for future generations, you really haven't done them any favors. There's a lot of intrinsic things about galvanizing on both the environmental and economic side. On the environmental side, it's created out of natural materials. Both iron and zinc are natural elements abundantly found in the Earth's crust. And zinc is a healthy metal. It's essential to life. We all require it to live. In addition, both the steel and the zinc are 100% recyclable without the loss of properties, which means they can be used as steel and zinc again and again, really creating an infinitely renewable resource. Because of the longevity of the galvanized coating and the way that it performs for 50 years, 75 years, 100 years or more without maintenance means you're we're using less resources throughout the life to maintain it, both from an environmental standpoint and from an economic standpoint. You're not spending money to maintain it. You're also not wasting resources to replace it. Hot Dip Galvanized Steel is a sustainable, infinitely renewable building material that improves the quality of life now and in the future. The fact Hot Dip Galvanized Steel is used in virtually every industry is durable for generations without maintenance, saves tax dollars, in both the private sector and public sector, and uses natural materials, namely zinc, which is known as the healthy metal, is a very important message for our industry. It is one that we think is important for society and one we're proud to communicate every day. Our industry has grown about 65% in the last decade or so. We need to encourage galvanizers to embrace new value-added services to make it easier for specifiers to use galvanized steel and to give them every confidence that when they do specify galvanized steel, they will be getting the highest quality product consistently. For more information, visit www.galvanizeit.org.